Hi, this is Aaron with Zolotech. Today I wanted to show you the Amazon Kindle app for iPhone. So right now you can see it just loaded. Let me go back to home and uh, we'll wait for it. Actually what it's doing is when you first start this app it, it, it looks, there we go, it actually asks you to sign in with your account <clears throat> your Amazon account you sign in and it links to your Amazon account if you already have an Amazon Kindle and you've bought books on there they'll show up automatically here these were all free books I figured I'd try it out uh, if you go on the Amazon Kindle store on Amazon you buy these you click buy even though it's, it doesn't cost you anything next time you open this app it downloads them right into your your uh, iPhone no hookup anything if I go to the first book here the whale catchers it loads, expands, and you can see everything. Now you can just scroll. You've got your options, and the way you get there is you touch the bottom. This will bring you back. The plus will bring you back to full screen. This book here will give you the different things, the table of contents, beginning, exam, for example. Here you can change the font size with the A. You can make it bigger, smaller. Um, and here we can refresh and retrieving the fur furthest page read. Here you can scroll down on the bottom. You can scroll to the page you want. I want to scroll to that page. I go there. If I want to change the font. Bigger, smaller, smallest. There you go. Depending on how well you see or what hurts your eyes, that sort of thing. Go back home. So you can search if you have a ton of books. Let me hit the info here. And you can see it's, it's registered to me. You've got help about, learn about the Kindle feedback, you know, support, terms of use, legal stuff there. So we click done. So here's another book. Open that. Now, if you buy a book, they're going to show you the real book cover. Just like the Kindle. The cool thing is, is if I go to page 3 or wherever I'm at now, and I have a Kindle, and I stop reading this, and I exit the app, it syncs back with WhisperSync. On the Kindle, it will bring me to the same page. And, so, and back and forth. Very, very cool. This is like the killer app for the iPhone. It's free. Um, it's one of the killers, that along with Podcaster, which is now not the same. Now, you can buy the books on here with Amazon. It tells you how to get, get the books. I just thought I'd show you this. It just came out, so I figured I'd record this. You can also use on Safari. If you go browse the store on Safari, hit buy, purchases it, you're good to go. You come back, you load the app, and it'll show up right here. Your book, new books, works just like the Kindle, only without a Kindle. So, of course, you don't get the big screen, the, the e-ink, but you do get the books. And if you're on the go, here it is for you. Again, that's the Kindle from Amazon for your iPhone or iPod Touch. This is Aaron with Zolotech. I'll see you next time.